हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी शोइंग यू दैट हाउ बेसिकली यू कैन फेच एंड डाउनलोड ए कंप्लीट गिटहब रिपोजिटरी लोकली इनसाइड योर फाइल सिस्टम प्रोग्रामेटिकली यूजिंग नोट शेयर्स यूजिंग चाइल्ड प्रोसेस मॉड्यूल लेट सपोज यू विजिट गिटहब डॉट कॉम एंड यू वॉन्ट टू बेसिकली डाउनलोड ऑल द कॉन्टेंट्स ऑफ ए फोल्डर विदाउट हैविंग टू do it manually you can automatically do it using programmatically let me have this repository here you will see this is my public repository the repository needs to be public you can't download private ones uh, basically i need to copy this link here and this is my node js script here that i am writing here all the source code is given in the description of the video so first of all guys uh, here we will need to uh, import the Execute method from the child process module. We need the child process module here. Child underscore process. And after this, we will simply uh, have the download URL. So from which we need to download. So this is our URL of the repository. And then basically we need to provide a destination folder. So where we need to uh, download all the content of it. Destination folder. And here we will. need to create a folder guys inside the root directory i will create that folder public so inside this folder guys we will be downloading the content of this github repository and after this we will execute this method this lets you come uh, execute uh, command line instructions so we will have a git command here guys so git should be installed inside your system git clone and then basically we will pass this download url and then we need to pro provide the destination folder that's all this is the command guys and it will run automatically once it is completed you will get your output so this is basically the callback function standard output standard error so three parameters are passed here guys error standard output standard error this callback function and right here guys if any sort of error take place if the url is not correct in that case we will console log the error and we will simply return else we will simply say that your console log the standard output that's all and this is all the code guys that's all this is the script which will automatically now if i run this script here just notice in the left hand side here node index.js it will take some time guys now it will create uh, if you see all the code is downloaded automatically this is my or to code here this is you can see that all the directory structure if you match it from my github repository this is index.html profile.html and this is readme file here you can see the main problem manually doing it guys uh, you need to first of all go to the repository click the download button and it will download this inside a zip file then you need to extract it open a new folder and then do that process but this node js script just eliminate all the process it directly downloads all the content in a folder you just need to make a folder public folder that's all you can create basically choose a different repository this will increase the process of downloading the repository and uh, let's suppose i have a different one to enter calculator let me search it on github and let's suppose i want to download this one so i need to simply copy this one address so i just need to paste the url this is basically the script here and that's all we just need to run this once again it is saying that uh, git clone uh, destination path public already exist so for this to do guys what we can do is that basically uh, destination public so what we can do we can have a uh, a dynamic directory structure so we will be having this public folder but we will be creating this uh, date dot now 
that so this is basically automatically it will create multiple folders out there so let me just delete this and start from scratch let me just show you so this is uh, let me now create that public folder so now if I run this guys what you will see so now it has created that folder guys automatic this folder if I reveal this so it has created a dynamic folder you'll see so now I will not be having that problem we have the public folder and then we have this random folder which will create this one like this and now if I run it for the second time I will not get that error and uh, let's suppose I need a different one let's suppose this one I can simply copy the address you can just make it into a complete express application as well to take this URL dynamically so if you run this so it, now it will create another folder you can see that this is basically so this is a great script guys guys uh, which basically increase the utility process from github by copy pasting all the github repository code directly inside your folder structure Thank you very much for watching this video and I will be seeing you in the next video.